Squarespace is actually amazing for blogging. It offers a built-in blog functionality and it allows for a fairly deep amount of customization. But one thing it doesn't have, or at least it doesn't have front and center, is the ability to filter items in a blog. Now, there are third-party plugins that do this and they are amazing. But Squarespace doesn't have a, a toggle that says add a filter to the blog. So you can't filter by tag or by category or date posted or whatever it may be. But there's one simple trick that we can do which uses something called an archive block. And this archive block acts as our filter. I always tend to stick that next to a search block as well. So it looks like a really comprehensive and sleek filter system for any blog that I build. And we can do this in, I think the title of the video is gonna say 30 seconds. It might take me 60 seconds, but we'll see. So the first step is to go into our blog itself. And then we wanna go into edit and we wanna edit the main page. So let's add a section above the blog. And I'm just gonna add a blank section in here. Let's make this nice and small. And then what we want to do is add something called an archive block. And we want to choose to go from the blog, like so. And then we want to change the display to a drop down. Then we want to change the drop down title to filter. And then we can group it by anything you see here. So month, year, or the category tag, etc. I'm going to go with category. And then there you can see we've got our filter. So if we were to make this nice and small, we can also add to the side a search bar. So if we put in search, like so, we'll get rid of that text block. You can see within less than a minute, we have a search and filter system set up for our blog. So if I expand this, you can see that looks really clean. Now we click to go down and this shows off all of our categories. If we click category two, then it filters for the category on it will filter for category one. Now, this isn't the greatest slickest solution, but it looks fairly decent. It works and it requires zero code. So hopefully this helps. If it has, make sure to leave a like, hit subscribe and check out all the Squarespace resources in the description below.